What's up, everybody? He just hit 800 likes right when I was going to start, so now we got to watch this. This is awesome. What's up, New Line? Michael Kittle, thanks for throwing the raid my way when you got in there. Mike the Greek, what's going on? Dick Lacrosse, how's it going? Rebel Stacker, good to see you. Did you change your icon? I can't see what it is. Can't see what it is. I'll have to look at your channel later. Joe Nelson, what's going on? You are in for tonight. Thank you very much. Yo, Adrian, how's it going? Hey, again, let's have some fun. Hunt some silver. Shout out to everybody. What's up? C. Muron, Roy M., good to see you. Carl's Coins in the house. Iron Jim, number seven. It's going good. I hope you're doing well. What's going on? Coyote Whackers in the house. What's going on? Holy cow. Let's see who wins the 800 likes. Let's see who wins it. Just came by to hit the like. Thanks, Roy. I appreciate you, brother. Tonight is going to be a good, good time with some uh, 50 and 100 and hopefully maybe 150 like giveaway. We will see. We will see how that goes. Let me shut off Rob's. He just finished it. Who'd that go to? I can't even see it. Doo -doo. Phenotypical. All right. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Let's see. Hey, Ali Stacker. Good to see you. Grant Miller up in the house. What's going on? 426 Rich, how's it going? Samir Hunt says, won't be me. Hey, you never know. You never know. In two years, I think I've won one, actually won two giveaways on that. One of them, somebody entered under my name and I won it. But call me out. How's it going? Coin Quester, good to see you. Desert Rat Stacker, what's going on? Holy moly, good to see everybody tonight. Joe Sharp's in the house. Holy cow, let's do this real quick. Let's add some points. Viewers, there we go. Let's copy that. Put all the points in. Let's make sure the bot is working correctly. Yep, added points. There we go. Hey, Caveman 911, what's going on? The other Jimmy, my coin caves in the house. What's going on? Cat Man Dooism. It has been a long day for me as well, brother. If you could see, my face is getting super, super red. And I guess I could put the lights down a little bit there. Super, super red. Christopher Hart, Nancy Barber says, incoming, watch out. Good to see everybody. Silver Bowl 30, what's going on? New Line says, welcome to the Beaver Den. <laughs> we told you to give you a hard time for melting the bike. That was so long ago. Holy cow. Jim Arganziano, what's going on? Richard Sappington, what is this I hear about a melty bike? Yep, that video is still up. That was a fun one to do, actually. Very fun because the whole time I was doing it, I knew I was going to get so much backlash for it, but people just don't know the story about the bike. So, too easy. Big C Richardson, Jonathan Friend, Mark Scarlotta, T Love It Coin Hunter, happy birthday on Friday, Coin Questers in the house. Oh, I missed a whole bunch. Where'd it go? Danny Seeley, uh, Peter Bowes, Just W, Brickatech fan, Larry Powell the second. What's going on? DMC's up in the house, Silver Bowl 30, Jose Ariaga. Carl Anderson, you're in, you're in for the night. Bo Palmer, what's going on? Do, do, do. See anybody else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Michael Hargis. Rob sent me. Glad to be here. Thanks, Michael Hargis. Thank you for being here. What's going on? Frank Mon, Southern Metal up in the house. Patrick Johnson, Bike Schmike, he says. Oh, yeah. I, I knew I was going to get so much kickback for it. But I even got I even got a couple like strongly worded emails for it about, like, you're just ridiculous. You could have, like sold it to somebody or you know donated it whatever i was like no not a chance steel wheels 99 what's going on cm silver good to see you brother let's see i don't want to miss anybody that's why we're doing this linda wallace how's it going do 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 jan lewitt my brother from canada what's going on uh do do and if we got some new people in here we'll add the points right there what did you do what are you talking about grant miller was there a giveaway that you missed? No, there is no giveaway going on right now. There is no giveaway going on right now. All I'm doing is adding points so when new people get in here, they get registered into the bot so they can uh, do the giveaways when we do them. Does anyone know where the nail clippers are? Just asking. Why, Richard? Why? Mine look just fine. Let's see. What's going on? Crafty Dragon's in the house. Farmer K, how's it going? Sparkle Flare, good to see you as well. All right, let's see. With the bike. I don't know what you're saying. With the bike. Oh, man. Love the bot. All right, let's see. 
I know, New Line. Kittle started. Kittle started something. Kittle started something. I don't like to met to dis delete anybody's messages if I really don't need to. But when somebody starts a giveaway one like that and they just do the exclamation mark enter and then everybody else just follows them, you're like, come on, man. There's no giveaway going on right now. It's okay though. Desert Rat Stacker got the mini loafs today. That is awesome. That is awesome. That's all right, Sparkle Flare. It's only gonna be one box tonight. One box. Let's see. Actually, let's put up the rolls again. There is 10 rolls left, as I recall right now. Just a quick check. All right, there we go. There are. Okay. Ha! <laughs> Rebel Stacker says, sorry, eh? Uh, let's see. Hey, Teddy Ted, what's going on? Come on, Kittle. You're supposed to know these things. Get it together, Kittle! Oh, man. Yeah, there will be a giveaway at 50, 50 likes. Hey, Jimmy Lacari, Good to see you, man. Timothy Morell, how's it going? Jeremy Albritton, my brother, what's going on, bro? Holy cow. It has been a long day for me. I actually drank my first Red Bull today in like a good six to eight months. A good six to eight months. <laughs> Jeremy says, come on, J-Dub. Let's go. Oh, man. Jeremy, there's no giveaway. Dang it. Oh, jeez. Hey, what's up, Party Pickle? Good to see you. I guess I need to turn on subtitles. Yeah, because so Kittle's listening. He's on a Zoom meeting right now, but he's listening to the stream, so that's probably why. Carlos Coins, what's going on? Holy cow. The Phantom giveaway is underway. Stop it. Thank you for the carpal rifle round. The bumbling USPS took it to detour to Texas for a week. Made it here. Yeah, I'm telling you, the mail is getting a little crazy right now. Bo Palmer, I have 10 rolls left. 10 rolls left. Uh, do, do, do. Let me refresh just to make sure. And yes, 10 rolls left. 10 rollers left. He's throwing up the pickle in OG22. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, geez. Do, do, do. Line of ash four inches from my car window from the 60,000. Holy cow, Big C. I hope you guys are safe out there. Holy cow. That custom porn silver coin should be here tomorrow. Awesome, Jonathan friend. There's 52 people like, like watching. Why don't we have 50 likes, says Grant. I don't know. You better, you better follow what Grant says. I'm just saying. You better do what Grant says. If not, it'll cause some problems here. I don't know. I see 65 likes right now. 66. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, okay. There we go. So, you know what? Let's do a 50 like giveaway before we even start. So, what we're going to do, it's going to be... We're going to do this on a short timer. This is going to be three minutes. We're going to open the giveaway right now. I'm going to add points to everybody. Add points to give away and to do that and enter space one. That is how you enter exclamation mark. Enter space one. Get in there. Have you heard anything from the captain of the ship? Derek, I talk to him every single day. Do, do, do. Whole hunting and camping area is gone. Oh, big C. That's mad. That's bad, man. Party pickle. Yes, I got two of your packages. I actually had been going to the post office every single day. I usually go like every other day. Uh, but I went there yesterday, and every package you see on my table back here, I got yesterday in my P.O. box that's like this big. They were just crammed in there. I was like, awesome, thanks, thanks. And one of them was silver shot, and it was busted all over inside the package. So I'm really glad the package didn't get busted. Jim Argenziano, here's five for good, strong coffee. Ditch the Red Bull. Jim, I have, oh, man. Yes, I have some good coffee. Uh, Canadian Ryan sent in some good coffee. I have some good coffee. Holy cow. A lot of California is on fire. Yeah, I talked to Big Mill. He, uh, there's a spot where he goes to work, and literally right on the side of the road is on fire. So it's crazy. Just crazy. I love getting packages like Christmas. You're right. Especially when you... There we go. Thank you, Jim Argenziano. That is awesome. Especially when you get them all at once. Let's see. Gonna need a size of P.O. box so I can push it to the max. Jeremy, if it's too big, they'll just put it in one of those really, really big ones. 
I'm not drinking that chicory down there. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, geez. No, 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 no. So I do, uh, I drink coffee once in a while. I used to drink it literally every single day, like two or three pots a day. And then I just, uh, I just kind of like gave up on it for a bit. Black Rifle, yep. So yeah, Black Rifle supports veterans and uh, Death Wish is veteran owned. So I drink Death Wish um, all the time. I actually used to drink um, Black Rifle when I was in Germany and then I got in trouble for importing coffee into the country. So I, uh, yeah, I kind of got in trouble for that. We got 30 seconds left on the giveaway. If you haven't entered, SMH mark, enter space one, and we will get in there. Did we finally name your beaver Gladys? Uh, nobody has come up with a name yet, New Line. There's no name. Once I hear a name and I think it's going to be a good one, it'll, you'll just know. You'll just know. Do, do, do. Black Rifle is really good. I really like the one that's called Murdered Out. That is one of the darkest ones they do that uh, is not... So I really hate French roast coffee, uh, but Murdered Out is as dark as you can get without going to French roast. For, French, for me, French roast just tastes burnt and it tastes nasty. All right, let's see. The giveaway is over. So let's pick a winner for one of these BU Benjis that I got in that, un, that circulated roll. I'm going to say BU, but you know... They are just nice. These are the ones that I got in that Atmex roll that I just felt like giving away. So that's what they are going to go. So let's see. Five, four, three to one. Silver Bowl 30. Hey, big country, what's going on? Do, do, do. You just know the right beaver say, <laughs> yo, Adrian. <laughs> oh, man. Nice, fr shiny Franklin half there. Kittle, did you see that I put oh, in the description a Ben Franklin half instead of a Benji just for you? Silver Bull 30. You are welcome. Now, please email me. You can do that by typing exclamation mark email in the chat. And my email will come up. Let's see. 50 likes right there. Uh, to do. All right, so there we go. The email's right there, so just please send me an email with that, with your uh, your shipping information and your name so I can get that to you. So I plan on doing the shipping tonight because I totally missed it on Monday, um, but plan on doing it tonight because I will not be back from work until sun Saturday mail call more than likely. More than likely. Let's see. All right, let's get this hunt underway. We do have 10 more rolls left if somebody else wants to get in. But Dick Lacrosse, Dick Lacrosse, you are first. Uh, you're going to hear my work radio going off to you. See you later, Jeremy. Have a good night, brother. Let's see. Let's get this camera situated right there. All right, Dick Lacrosse, I need a number, and I need what you would like for your 90, Benji Walker or Kennedy. And we will get it started. We'll get it started. We'll get it started. I know. Stop it. New line with the 5-1-2. <laughs> Lurking and jaws are sizing. <laughs> Getting these chops chiseled. Oh, jeez. Man, that was a conversation for the ages the other night. Holy cow. Holy cow. 15 and a walker. All right, let me get you a walker here. Thank you, New Line, for that. That is hilarious. All right, let's see. We have a 45 out of Philly right there. And let's grab you some dimes. <laughs> Bucky Benjamin Beaver could do that. 64 and a 52 right there. My dimes are getting a little light. I did order four rolls of them, though, so they should be here soon. Uh, let's see. Why says Bucky for the Beaver's name because of its two buck teeth? So that could be. I was also thinking Bucky the Beaver because I had that Bucky keychain back there. 
I don't know. I don't know. Benjamin, Bucky Benjamin Bieber. Derek Bowles with the hi. <laughs> you might have new line. I'm thinking that might is a little, yeah. Sister Silversmith, hey, how's it going? Good to see you. We'll be checking out your store, checking in to hit the like. Oh, thanks, Sister Silversmith. I made this one. This is the hoodie, and I do have the t-shirt, and oh, you know what? Totally forgot. I totally forgot this tonight. I should have mentioned it on Rob's stream. I should have mentioned it. I got the socks. I got the socks in. Right there. Jan's pushing hard for Bob. Bucky's Wisconsin Beavers mascot, and they rule. Oh, I see. Hey, PGA Loom, how's it going? Callan Broski, what's going on? Chandler the Beaver. Oh, geez. But look at that. I finally got the socks in. One thing I really like about their socks, they're like they're like thin, like suit socks, you know. But sweet, sweet. Do you sell them in small size? I'd have to look at the, uh, let's look at the Teespring real quick. And then Dick Lacrosse is like, dude, come on now. Well, come on now. All right, let's see. So let's go here and let's go to the socks. Uh, let's see. So it doesn't say, yeah, it doesn't say a um, size. It's a one size. So it's three and a half inches by 18 inches. Yep, it only is a one size thing for socks, it looks like. My own is Big Brown Beaver. Oh, geez. Do they go well with my sandals? That's what I'm talking about. Rob's socks were too big for the three wood. Oh, I got you for the clubs. Nice. That good line goes well with the meetup line from the lady during your metal detecting video. That lady was hilarious. That lady was hilarious. In a full box, uncirculated 2019 D nickel. Should I sit on the most for the rolls for later? Just a few. Sell them. Teddy Ted, I would sell them. I would sell them. I do not like to sit on stuff for a long, long time for no reason. I would sell them. Either that or if, if you got, if you can sit on the 100 bucks up for it or you could sit on the 10, the, uh, the 10 <laughs> Southern Metal. <laughs> got me off guard. If you could sit on the 10 rolls of, uh, of nickels for a while and then somehow a DDO or something comes up uh, in that one, then maybe you know hold them for that. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't hold my breath for that. Myself, I literally would just get rid of them as soon as I could. Let me get this stuff over here, put it over there. <sighs> Southern metal. Possibly full of Brazilian. <laughs> oh my gosh. You guys drive me nuts. Got all my W's together, and they're 37. Nice big country. That is awesome. Hanging out in the hot tub, watching the stream. Just got her going. That's what I'm talking about. I wish I had a hot tub. I barely even have a tub. I can't even, like, sit down and put my legs out in my tub. All right, let's go. Roll number 15, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Right there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's see. Yep, some of these rolls are going to get thrown away. Come on. Do, do, do. I thought the beaver's name was Harriet. Oh, man. I don't know. Maybe that should be a uh, maybe that should be a vote on thing for uh, the name on the community tab. Silver Bowl 30 with the $4 super chat. Email sent this to help on shipping. Thanks again. Silver Bowl, thank you very much. You did not need to send in for shipping, but thank you very much anyways. That is awesome. Thank you for the super chat. Your name will be coming up here. And... A second. How about... No. Nope. All right, I'm going to get back to something, and then it's going to come... Right there. Come on now. Jeez. New line standby. <laughs> Holy cow. Send you some of my vinyl stickers when they get in. Dick Lacrosse. Dude, when you said that, I was like, that is awesome. That is awesome. That is awesome. It's hilarious. All right, let's get into these 10 rolls. Oh, geez. <laughs> he says, no problemo. Where'd my box go? There it is. All right. 
let's keep up with the search order here. There we go. If you want to if you want to watch the search order while we're going through, it's just exclamation mark order. There's really not a whole lot to see. There's no auction stuff tonight, so not really stuff to look at. But if you pretty much want to see my screen while I'm going through, and we got a quarter on the first roll. Quarter on the first one right there. Let's get this thing to focus. There we go, a little bit. I like Beverly for the beaver. It sings. Hey, Silver Hair Seeker, how's it going? Oh, cheese and rice. All right, here we go. All right, let's go. That's all right, PGA Loom, no problem, no problem. I will be doing some more silver pours when I get time. Uh, like I said, I am working this week and next week. So videos are gonna be a little slower and uh, pours are gonna be a little slower. I do have to find time. Wait, did I already do a Monday Meltdown video? I know, I don't think I did. I usually do the Monday Meltdowns on Saturday, so. I might have to uh, do that on Sunday. Might be a super, super late night on Sunday. We'll see. See how that goes. We shall see. But I hope everybody liked last Monday's uh, Monday Meltdown. This Monday would be a little bit similar, but I don't know if I'm gonna do copper. Do, do, do. How about Glaber? It's a Latin word. I don't know what Glaber means. Is that beaver in Latin? I like Harry for the beaver. I think that's a general consensus. How about Cunning Beaver? <laughs> Name him Justin. <laughs> Justin Beaver. That would be hilarious. I'm leaning towards Harriet, but I've never had a pet that I would want to call Harriet, so I don't know. I don't know. New lines that I just talk to talk. Doesn't matter if the target listens or understands. Oh, and right there. Right there. Come on. Right there. We have. Come on. Maybe. A 40. It's a 40. A 1969. Come on. You can look it up. Glaber. Oh, man. Now I'm going to have to type it so I look it up. Things to look up. Glay, dang it! Now the caps lock got stuck on Glaber. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh man, caveman! I feel we can do better than Harriet. I think so too. All right, let's go. Five more rolls left. Five more rolls. Come on, Chewy or Feller? Chewy Beaver or Feller Beaver. Let's see. Come on. Don't settle, says <laughs> JW. Oh, man. Let's Do, 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 do. Bustin' Beaver instead of Justin Beaver? How about Bustin' Jeever? That wouldn't really make sense though with the Jeever. Bustin' Beaver is actually a really good one. Yeah, I know a new line. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna come. It's gonna come, and we're all gonna be like, "Yes, that's it, right there. That is it, 100%." One of these days, perfect name will come along. How about the monster beaver? <laughs> oh man, side not the type of name I was thinking of. PGA. Oh man, you guys are hilarious. 
hilarious. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. I almost like, where'd that 40 go? It's under the microscope. Come on. Beaver Stevens. All right, there we go. We have a 90, a Walker right there. We have two 40s, two dimes, and a quarter. Let's get a quarter. How can you destroy that bike? Got to go see you Sunday. Ah, <laughs> Mr. Turtle Turtle. There we go. We got a 1942 silver quarter right there. There we go. How about the highest super chat this month? Names viewer for next month. Can do a monthly name change. No, Coin Quester, because you wouldn't change your you wouldn't change your kids' names. You wouldn't change your pets' names. You can't do that. And I'm not gonna ask for super chats. That's no. I think it's kind of out of my realm to be asking for super chats like that. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Valerie Gina Beaver. Oh <laughs> Southern Metal. Oh man. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Dick Lacoste right there. Oh, man. Jan says, how about Woody? Keep your beaver clean to prevent a smelly beaver like your smelly Benji, says Derek. <laughs> oh, gosh. Let's see. Right there. I got some shipping to do tonight. Some shipping. Get this stuff all organized and out of here. All right, Dick. Thank you very much for the uh, donation to the channel tonight and supporting the channel. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh oh. And Roy Hathaway coming in clutch at the end. Roy Hathaway, thank you very much. Are you in the chat? Did I, did I miss you? Did I miss you or not? I just didn't see your name come by. Roy Hathaway came in for the last 10. Let's put him on the search order. Let's see. Do, do, do. And there we are. Right there is a search order if you'd like to follow along. And thank you very much, Roy, for getting the last 10 rolls. We need a contest. Whoever gets the beaver name wins. Uh, beaver VIP. <laughs> the wicked beaver. Homer. Roy says, not here. <laughs> oh, man. New Line says, is borrow circling around the southeast for two weeks? Yeah, I'm telling you, I get emails every day. Hey, where's my package? Where's my package? I'm like, dude, I'm telling you. I can't help with the post office right now. I think they even said that the postmaster general had to go testify. Like, I'm not going to get into politics, but that tells you something right there that the post office is going to be a little slow. And since everything we do depends on the post office, it kind of sucks for us. All right, let's go. Carl Anderson, where are you at, brother? We got two, four, six, eight and 10 right there from my man carl anderson what's up deborah waltz good to see you mike the greek says deborah the beaver should be named merkin merkin musky what's up prize hunter how's it going eager beaver <laughs> oh man benji please says carl thank you for getting me on that one let's see we have a 1954 denver right there Let's grab you a 40 since we're throwing out beaver names. How about these two? De Bloom or Smithy? De Bloom or Smithy? I don't know. Do they have meanings behind them? Mike says, look it up. Which one? Hold on. Hold on. Merkin. All right. Let me go back to my list here. I wish I could put it where you guys could add to the Google Doc, but not delete. Uh, but I can't. Now I can put it where you could add notes, but that's not a. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Hey Jesse Thornton, what's going on? I'll talk politics with any time. I feel like we would have the same views. Jonathan Friend, I have no political views. No political views. I don't do politics. What's up, Nick H? Yes, I'm late. Sue me. Work sucks. 
Nick, I almost didn't have a stream tonight because of work, so I totally understand. We'll have to change this beaver to a boy. I thought the beaver was a girl. Come on now. What's up, Farmer K? I am doing well. I hope you are too. Holy cow. Let's go, Carl Anderson with 10 rolls. Let's go. Let's go, Carl. Let's go. You need some dimes. He's like, dude, don't forget my dimes. It's the only reason I come here. Let's go. Two. Have a 57 and a 64 right there. Come on. I'm with you. I have no political views. Yeah, Sparkle Flare, either I... Well, so here's the thing about politics. I don't... I purposefully don't educate myself on politics. Now, I read on... I read on stuff that are issues and stuff going on. We got a silver dime right there. But, but here's the deal with that. I read on stuff, but I already don't trust the, the issues. I already don't trust the issues that I read on. So I'm kinda, yeah. Wrong hat for a girl, let's call it Asa. Ooh, Derek might be onto something there. Asa the beaver. That way, every time Asa comes in, he's like, "Wait, why are you ta why are you saying my name?" And right there, I was looking for the coin that fell, but right here, is it gonna focus? I don't think it's gonna focus. This camera's having an off night tonight. Either way, we have a 68 Denver 40 percenter right there. Come on! Why is my stuff going crazy? Let's see. Come on. Do, 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 do. Ah, man, let's call it Asa. <laughs> oh, looking both weeks and not messing with a good time in the coin hunts. Yeah, I'm working all this week and all next week. And I'm actually working every overnight until... So I have about Saturday at noon ish off so I can do my stream on Saturday and I'll be working overnight into Sunday and I have Sunday night off and then the rest of the night so pretty much watch Gina R's bill search for star notes I hadn't checked my bills in a while ended up with a ten dollar I got 95.1 percent 98.3 percent and 98.9 holy cow so that's awesome and you're talking on the rarity scale or are you talking like the cool index either way that's pretty pretty cool I uh, I had a bill, a picture of a bill sent to me today uh, by my mom, and she said, I got this at work, do you want it? And I was like, yes, let me show you this. And if my mom's phone number shows up, don't call her. Here it is. All right, it's not going to show up. Look at that. Crisp. Fifty dollar nineteen seventy seven. Nineteen seventy seven star note. Holy cow. So that is getting sent my way. Uh of course as soon as uh as soon as I pay her for it because she she was like, I'll trade you for a new one. I'm like, Ugh, I'm going to owe you more than that. I'm going to owe you more than that for that bill. And so I'm looking at prices. I'm looking at stuff. And she's obviously going to be like, no, just take it. It's only 50 I paid $50 for it. I'm like, nah, I don't know. No, Nick, she just said straight trade for it because my mom doesn't really know anything about money. That's why I, I, I messaged Kittle right when I got that. And I was like, hey, look at this. I didn't have my book on me because I was at work um, or even the ability to get online and look at a book. So I was like, uh, yeah, I don't know, but just posted my push for 200 subs video in Discord. Lovely star note. Thanks, Big Country. And then if you guys have not checked out Big Country's uh, his channel, you can put exclamation mark funny in the chat and you can go check out his channel. Slipper of fifty and say thanks, mom. Yeah, I'm. I'm. She's definitely going to get more than fifty dollars. So what's it worth? It, if it was in BU condition, 
uh, it would be worth two hundred dollars. So we were looking that up today. If it was in what do you say, like the best possible, whatever BU is for dollars, I'm guessing it's BU, but it would be worth two hundred dollars. Right there, we got a silver quarter. Come on. So um, I'm definitely going to give her a hundred for it, but she's probably going to end up putting it back in my Christmas money. You know, she's just gonna be like, here, just take your money back. So I don't know. Either that or if I get it when I see her, then I'll probably just trade her and take her out to a nice dinner at the restaurant I used to work at because that's definitely going to be more than the $150. So either way, she's going to definitely do well, get money on it. I'm going to do my first penny hunt tomorrow. Nice tea, love it. That's what I'm talking about. And that's why I asked her, I said, please, like, put it in a plastic sleeve, put it in, oh, right there, almost missed it, we got a silver dime, come on. You know, we, uh, I had to make sure, like, please take care of it, please don't fold it, you know, and if you send it to me, please put it in, like, a protected box or something, you know, not just an envelope, and she's like, I know, I know, I know, I got it. I'm like, okay, I'm just making sure. Cause you never know. I'd see a $50 bill in a uh, in a paper envelope. So we'll see. But more than likely, I'll call her tomorrow or even after the stream. It's only 10 o'clock right now. But we shall see. You can't just give monies to moms. You got to sneak it in them. Oh, I know Silver Hair Seeker. And here's here's the funny thing is that uh, I was telling somebody. Like, you know your mom's not going to take that money, right? I'm like, yeah, but she can't help me from sending it to her via Venmo. <laughs> hey, Juan Velasquez, good to see you. And SM on SoundCloud, how's it going? Good to see you, too. Let's see. Come on, one more. One more. Let's go. And nothing, nothing from the side view. That's for Big Mill. Big Mill had to go to bed super early today because he's got to be up at three o'clock. I was on the phone with him and you could just tell that he needed to like get off the phone and go take a shower and go to bed. But I just kept talking, of course. Here we go, we got a 90, a 40, two dimes. Let's add two more dimes and a quarter, come on. Got my dad's rolls of Wheaties and going through them, putting them in order, so I might be lurking a bit. That's all right, Big C. Thanks for being here, though. You got to make them think it, hit it somewhere, forgot it. No, no, no. How about Funky Beaver? I don't know. Mom, your stash bot needs work. Uh, Jonathan Friend, no auctions tonight uh, unless you guys really want them. There is a 41 quarter right there. Come on. Uh, I really don't have a whole lot. Uh, I don't have any poured pieces that I could auction off, and I do like to do the poured pieces for the auctions. Uh, oh, and forgot this 40 there. Come on now. Two more dimes right there, a 63 and a 64. We'll add those to the stack. Do, do, do. Joe Sharp says, I'm in for an auction. So I don't have a whole lot. I really only have two things right now that I could auction off, or I do have one other one. I have a roll of them, but I don't know. I don't like just grabbing things and going. I like having it organized, but either way. Ed Stonewall, what's going on, brother? I totally forgot to message you right before stream. Holy cow, shame on me. Shame on me, Ed told me, he's like, hey, I went in for rolls tonight, and I totally forgot to message him because I didn't know if I was going to make it work today. Holy crap, Ed Stonewall, I am sorry. Holy cow. Budget Coin Hunter says, I'd want to call the Beaver Morgan on account of the buck teeth. Hmm, I don't know. And I get what you mean by buck and a dollar. I'd rather pay for what I get than gamble. That copper mold you used was that custom made. Silver Hair Seeker, yes it was. That was made by the welders in my town. I went up to them and told them what I wanted. Planning these ports pieces for Sunday. I'm definitely going to have to head to bed early. Good night, New Line. We'll see you later. And Carl Anderson, thank you, good sir. Let me put this together for you. We'll get it out to you. 
Thank you for supporting the stream tonight. Man, now I feel bad because Eddie came in here and he was just like, bro, let me get in on the stream. I'm like, well, I mean, I could get you silver coins if you'd like to. Nope, I went in on the stream. Okay, dang it. Totally forgot. Thank you, Carl. Uh, a roll of what? Uh, Jonathan, they're BU Benjis. They're BU Benjis. Do, do, do. Budget said bad joke. I know, Budget. I, I had to explain it just in case anybody in the chat didn't understand it, too. All right, let's see who's up next. Joe Nelson, DC, with 20 rolls. With 20 rolls. Come on. Give me his coins, Farmer K. That's not that how that works. It's just not how that works. Let's see. Joe Nelson, 20 rolls. You know what? Let's count 10 off the end because that's going to be Roy's. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So these 10 are Roy's and those 20 are Joe Nelson's. Let's put them all over here. Get this box organized. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's do it. Bot, did the bot crash? I don't know. Let me see. Console. Does not look like the bot crash. What are you trying to do, PGA? Everybody's getting the heist? Yeah. Heist is going. Heist is going. Actually, let me look real quick. That yeah, doesn't tell me. There we go. No, the uh, the bot should be working. It's not going to tell you every time you enter in the heist. I just know it's it's on. On and going. Now there is a, uh, I will warn you guys, there is an update to the to the uh, bot, and I'm going to do it before next stream, so wish me luck. All right, Joe Nelson, are you in the house? Are you in the house? And if you are, what would you like for your 90s? And then we will get the other stuff drawn for you. DA Sales in the house. What's going on, brother? DA Sales pulling out the awesome uh, Canadian silver on the cards. Uh, if you guys don't know, they're the, the cards that the coins come attached to. Those are really, really cool, like collectible type things uh, that I usually like to get into. Um, I know a lot of people don't because they're like, I just don't like to pay extra money for the card when I'm just going to take the card or the coin off of the card. Um, but I like those type of things. So we got a 67 and a 68 from Denver for the 40s. And he said Benji's. So let's get him some Benji's. Benji will work or Walker. How about one of each? How about one of each? We got a 61 right there. And let's grab you a Walker. I know, Dar I know, Farmer K. I know. Right there, we got a Walker. Do, do, do. Keep that card. I know those are the things DA sales that I was talking about. Like, I do, I do like those cards uh, that a lot of coins come on, and some of the foreign coins that I like getting into come on cards. So there's some that are on the uh, the what is it? The Netherlands, the mint from the the Netherlands. Really, really cool cards. Let's see. We got four dimes. One, two, three, and let's find a Merc dime. Right there. We're getting slim. Hope those di those dimes should be here. Should is my favorite word. Should be here by Sunday. So we'll hope. 61, 64, 57, 42 right there. No, it's not a 42 over 41. It'd be easy to see, and it's not. Come on. Do, 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 do. Showing 97 likes. Three more for another giveaway. Get your second accounts. Let's see. Come on. 20 rolls for Joe Nelson, DC. Let's do it. Come on. And I might put this video up if Ed Stonewall says I can put it up, but I recorded his very first ever uh, silver pouring at my house the other day when he came over and hung out. So I am going to edit that video and put it together. That way he and his wife can see it. Um, and then I'm, if, with his permission, I'm going to put it on my uh, for the members videos. 
Would you trade a one ounce gold round for that roll? Would you trade a one ounce, one tenth ounce gold round for that roll? For what roll? For the 63 Benjis? It's not a full roll. But if you want to trade it for not a full roll, sure. <laughs> it's one I've had for a long time. Come on now. That green box has got to go. One hen, 100 friendlies sweet, says Muscle Shell. Let's see. So there is about two thirds of a roll left. Those I just use for giveaways, though. Here we go. Ed Stonewall says, heck yeah, all right. What's up, Mustang Dave in the house? What's going on, brother? Good to see you. The other uh, Norman Oklahonian, like Raven. Doo -doo. Let's see, 100 likes. All right, we will do that. You know what? After this roll, I'll get it started, and then you guys can enter. And then at the end of these rolls, then uh, then we will draw it. How about that? So that means you got to stay here until the end of these rolls, at least till the end of the rolls. All right, let's see here. You know, there's an awful lot of BU C3 Benji. You know, there's a bunch of under so I don't know budget. I don't know, man. Uh, I totally agree with that statement. I know I've had mine for, I've had that roll for about three months now. Um, but yeah, I totally agree. And so I wanted, I wanted to buy a BU roll from Atmex to try to get different dates so I could put some in my book and then give the rest away. Well, I got a whole roll of 63s. I think there was one 62 in there and the rest 63s. Now I saw the one that Raven got and his was all mixed dates and i was like dude that's awesome but they were a little bit less than bu so i don't know now he did get that uh now he did get that one roll that was the original bank wrap roll that was crap but there we go i just had four 20 dollar rolls of them in my last auction yeah for the 63s yep uh, there might be budget. I There very well could be. So there is the giveaway. Enter space one will get you into that giveaway. And I added points to everybody. So if you're here and in the chat, you will have points added to your name. Let's keep going for the rest of the 20 rolls. You have until the end of these rolls to get in there. And this again is for another one of those pretty darn close to be BU Benjis that came out of those rolls. Right there, we got a dime. Come on. Get on in there. Here we go. Dropping coins everywhere tonight. I'd buy them for 20, said Michael. Oh man. It just seemed odd to me that they're going out for so many channels all at the same time. It's all I don't know, budget. I think they're just a uh and right now the price of them is not ridiculously higher than a roll of circulated ones. So here we go. We got a silver dime right there. But I've had, like I said, I've had that roll for a couple months. Um, everybody, I did a video on it, so no better silver than a dime. Just saying. Let's see, 150 friendly, said Muscle Shell. Muscle Shell, go tell your 4,000 subscribers to get in here. And we just, uh, we just might, we just might get those 150 friendlies. Muscle Shell's like, listen, bro. My rock climbing, jeep driving people do not want to come in here and look at coins. 
Ben Detecting, what's going on, brother? Good to see you, man. We got a quarter. Come on. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Hey, Brooks Wilson, what's going on, brother? Good to see you as well. The hunt is going good. Let's see. We are now on 20 rolls. We got a giveaway going if you want to get in on it. It's just exclamation mark. Enter space one. To get in there for a uh, BU. Let's say 99% BU. Uh, Benji. Bogus. We love coins. All right. Muscle shell. That's what I'm talking about. Do, do, do. I would love to look at coins, especially if I could win one of them. Yep. Big Bill is miserable not being able to stream because of work, isn't he? T. Lovett, yes, he is. And he's got a lot of stuff going on with work, so. And right there, the 64, 90%er. Holy cow. Come on now. Where is it from? It is from Philly, right there. We got the 90. About a roll of mixed Benji's, only two or eight UBUs. Okay, pay 20 cents over melt. Well, 20 cents over melt for that? Not a problem. Not a problem. So pay a premium for BU. Probably always some premium. Yes. Yep, for sure. There we go. Come on. Here we go. Come on, feel the noise. What do you guys think of that idea I had in uh, in Rob's stream for my birthday? We do a stream with me and him together in his garage pouring silver together. What do you think? I know a lot of you are gonna be like, yes, we love it just because you guys love Rob. And it's gonna be fun, but I think it would be a blast. I think it would be a blast. We could even, because of Rob, we could make it a competition. And if he's lurking and listening, you just never know. We could make it a competition. Speaking of Raven, he just posted a singing video. He does he crack you up like me? And he says it's so hilarious at times. Must be the Norman thing. I love watching uh, Raven singing videos. I used to watch his singing videos before I even had Raven as a friend. You know. Oh, that's good, Carl. Right there. We should do the pours and an auction and after. When is the birthday? September. I'd be fanboy screaming, New Line, you would be. You would be. Bring your own metal and forge party. Yes, that's what, uh, so that's what I'm going to uh, be doing. One of these days, we're going to do a video together. Um, and we're both going to pour. We got another silver dime. And we're both going to pour. So I am going to bring my forge over to his house. Um, it's more than likely going to be the Devil Forge. Because the gas is just kind of a little more fun. Um, but yeah, you'd be favored by negative 1.5 pours. <laughs> oh, man. You two hanging out, fun to watch, porn, whatever. Yeah, so we're also going to do the Death Nut Challenge together one of these days. As soon as I can get over there, you know. I would love to be like, hey, Death Nut Challenge and Silver Pouring. But that's just danger and danger put together. It's not a good idea. Sounds good. The competitive juices will flow. Forged in Fire episode. Nice. Hey, Carper. Good to see you, brother. Good to see you. You should do a bike race and loser gets his bike melted. <laughs> Uh-oh, right here. Come on. We have a 40%er 1967 right there. Holy moly. Sitting here just holding it. Oh, garage, not so much garden on the right track. Virtual combine, yes. <laughs> oh, man. What the heck is Death Nut? That is a world's hottest peanut um, challenge. It's got different levels of, uh, of the different spices and stuff. You melted your bike, now do an AR. There's plans. That's all I'll say. There's plans. Let's see. What is that coin? Garbage. Garbage. Only worth the 50 cents it's worth. Come on. Hey, Stacy Oakley Thriller. Good to see you. On your way back, you shook up with Paw Spare Time for Boxes of Halves. 
I know, Roy. I've been thinking about that, but he's never contacted me, so I'm not going to go out of my way and contact him because I think that's a little too much. It's a little ste overstepping boundaries. I'm not going to go out of my way to ask somebody, hey, can you get me this? We got a silver quarter. Let's see. Farmer K, sorry for asking so many questions. You literally asked one question, bro. You literally asked one question. It's not that big of a deal. Too much fire involved. You're right, T. Love it. So with the with the uh, Devil's Forge, we would definitely have to pay attention 100% to the Devil Forge. Now, if we did a stream together, we would both use the electrical. We would both use the electric. That way, we could still talk and hang out and all that stuff. And uh, we wouldn't have to worry about like the temperatures of the pores because the electric ones are nice because you just set it and it's good. Feels like your insides are on fire for an hour, just an hour. Uh, are you in the death nut challenge? I have a death nut challenge. It's just waiting for me and Rob to uh, to do it. I was gonna do it with Nate Hunt's heat and a bunch of other people, and then he just kind of dropped me out of it. So I was like, eh, okay, just me and Rob then. It's all good, Farmer K. I literally stream for people to talk to me, so that's okay. Ben detecting said, I just need a box of nickels. I know, Ben. I, I, I need a box of anything right now. It would be great. I've got boxes of uncirculated pennies in there just getting sold by the day, and I wish people were just trading me rolls of pennies. Does Combine Destruction Derbies exist in the East or just Eastern Washington thing? Just W. So where I grew up in Iowa, that's definitely a thing. Definitely a thing. Kind of a fan of electric furnaces from the videos. Yes, I am definitely a fan of the electric furnaces as well. Uh, it allows me to set the furnace, walk inside, because it takes probably a good 20 minutes just to get up to like 800 degrees where I feel like I need to be out there watching it the whole entire time. But yeah. So now when I go to copper, aluminum, brass, all that stuff that are dirty metals anyways, they're going to smoke out. They've got crap in them. That's definitely going into Devil Forge. It's not going into electric. Now, the bad thing about that for the electric is that the electric doesn't do copper very well. So from everybody I've heard that has an electric, you have to get up, up to and past the melting point of whatever metals that you're melting. So silver melts at 960 degrees Celsius. So I pour at uh, 1100 degrees because that's where it's nice and hot and the crucible stays hot as well because the crucible is tall and skinny. So the top side gets cool. As soon as you pull it out, it gets cool and that silver will start to cool down uh, as you pour it. Let's see, let's get two quarters out. We got a 64 and a 54 right there. Put those away. But that's one thing you gotta watch on the electrical is that the top is gonna get cold or cooled down um, before the rest of it. So you're gonna have a string of solid silver on it. Death nut fire with devil forge fire. Well, yeah, not at the same, not at the same time. Three more dimes. See all 64s, I'm telling you, I am getting low. Do, 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 do. Joe Nelson, Joe Nelson, do you want to keep the dimes or do you want to trade five of them in for a 90? And if you do, tell me which 90 you want or just tell me you want the dimes. We can do that. Either way, that's a lot of the same year and same dime for you. But otherwise, there's what we got. I put the Merc on the side just because you probably want the Merc. But up to you. I am getting more anyway, so... Not like I need to save them. I just try to give everybody different years, different dates that are different dates and different mint marks. Kenneth Goodson, what's going on, brother? Thank you for the super chat. Holy cow. And he says, I'll take a Benji for the dimes. All right, let me see. One, two, three, four, five. And I'll give you the best condition one there is. There we go. We'll take those and let's grab a Benji. Uh, roll of nickels, just messing. I'm saving to have a bunch, a box of each to re-roll. Oh, nice. 
Here we go. We have A's 1960 out of Denver right there to add to it. There we go. Thank you, Kenneth Getson. You, you rock. That is loud. All right, let's put her away. Let's get her in here for Joe Nelson. Come on, work with me here. And Joe, thank you for supporting the channel. Thank you for supporting the stream tonight. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate ya. Where, there we go. Somewhat in order. Stuff on the desk everywhere. I got SoCal box breaks, poured bar here. Everything going on over this way. Nice, always take a Denver. Can you get not get any denomination boxes? T love it. No, I cannot. No boxes at all. My bank is uh, very, very irritated every time I go in there. I don't even say anything. I walk in the door and they just they all the tellers are like instantly busy, or somebody always goes to the back, or somebody always. I'm like, how are we doing on coins? And they're like, no. Okay, cool. Thank you. So. I have reverted to not talking to the tellers anymore. I literally just go in, I go straight to the manager's office and I say, how are we doing on coins? And she says, we're not ordering coins for right now. I'm like, you're not ordering any coins. So you don't have any business accounts in this bank that need coins. We'll order them for business accounts. Okay. Well, I still don't have a business account. So either way. All right, let's see. We're going to close this giveaway, and we're going to pick it for the 100 likes giveaway. Let's see. It's going to be one of these shiny, shiny Benjis. Let's, oh, man. Come on. You guys let me forget it. You let me forget the 90 and the 40 for Joe Nelson. There we go. Joe, I do apologize about that one. Let's get it put in there. Man, see? The envelope was all nice and nice. Found a nice beaver. That's what I'm talking about. What's up, Matt Van Creek? There we go. I blame it on you guys. You let me forget it under the microscope. All right, there it is. That one, 1963, five, four, three to one. Foobar. <laughs> Foobar, are you here? Are you here? Tell me they order them, but they don't mean they get them. You're right, Jonathan. You are right. Is Fubar up in the channel, up in the chat? There he is. All right, Fubar, please send me an email with your name, your address, and your channel name so I can get this to you. Congratulations. 100 likes giveaway right there. And there it goes into its new home. Come on. Right there. Yes, sir. And if you need my email, it is exclamation mark email and you can get it right there. There we go. Minimize that. What if you did a business account? I think that would have to order. So they don't have to order anything for a business account, but sometimes they do. Fact of the matter is I don't have a, a business. So I don't have a uh, business license right now. I know that. I 100% know that. I, I talk to Rob every single day. I talk to Big Mill every single day. I 100% know everything that goes about with coin roll hunting. But I do not have a business license. I refuse to get one in Louisiana and give Louisiana my tax money. My pickup bank told me that if you had a business account, you could have one roll of each per week. Yep. That's uh, And see, that's another thing, Ben, is that it's up to the bank manager what they want to give you. They could literally give you whatever they want to. And before, um, I just noticed something. So before this whole coin shortage stuff began, they even told me that they were going to start charging me more per box because I do pay per box. And I was like, oh, too easy. How much? How much? And they didn't give me a, they didn't tell me how much. And I was like, as long as it's not over ten dollars, because that's a little excessive, then okay, got it. You know, I'll pay it. Whatever. As long as you keep ordering me boxes, I'll pay it. Don't care. You know. So, caveman said, "Where'd all the coins go?" There's up and left, huh? Yep. You just never know, man. 
Like, and I, I've been a big believer of it's not a coin shortage, it's a logistical shortage. But it's just kind of ridiculous. All the 74 banks around you. That's crazy, Ben. That is crazy. All right, let's get to Roy Hathaway. Come on, Roy, where are you at? What would you like for your 90? Benji Walker Kennedy, let me know. I'll grab your 40. Seems odd for sure. It does, caveman. It does. You're right. But, again, it is what it is, and none of us can affect it. So it's kind of... Uh, Kinda dumb. I sell gold, silver, and prospecting equipment online through website, but I don't have a license for the same reason. Jonathan, I feel like you should have a license to do that because depending on how much money you make per year, uh, yeah, you, I would think you'd have to watch out for that. All right, let's see. You got two dimes. You know what? I grabbed a handful. Let's see. We're down to the last amount of dimes I got. Roy, been around forever, and the last box you sent me was freaking cool. Literally the last Merc dime I had. There we go. Come on, Roy. Come on. Now if you get any dimes in your rolls, it's going to be Rosie's, but you know. Uh, whatever 90 don't matter to me. Well, let's see. Same bank, same name. Yep. Yep. Do, do, do. But you never know. It's like I said, it's all up to the bank. It's not up to the Fed. It's not up to anybody. It's all up to the bank itself. And let's say if Wells Fargo has a policy that their president came out with and one roll of each denomination, then so be it. That's that's Wells Fargo. They are a business for profit, then that's what they can do. If there was a shortage, my federal credit union would still not have a two hundred dollar cap on the coin machine. Yeah. Starting to get better. Yeah. So, um, none of the places around here have went to absolutely no cash, but they've went to asking, can you please pay in exact change? If you can, they won't refuse it because they know the laws, but they just say, please pay in exact change if you can. But yeah. Do, do, do. Good night, Sparkle Flare. We'll see you later. We'll see you later. Now, if I start gaming later and you show up, I'm going to be like, I thought you said you were going to bed. But, either way. Let's go for Roy Hathaway. Come on. Do, do, do. Do, do. Come on, Roy. Oh, man. I just threw him in the wrong one. Oh, well. Come on, feel the noise. Keep track, don't let them fool you. Yeah, caveman. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, man. I get my fill of conspiracy theories every day when I talk to Big Mill, so I am pretty good. The money manager Marcus says she's not having any trouble getting rolls, but. Not enough to sell me some. She might be able to train me bank rolls for rolls. Yes, and I've even went that approach to my bank and said, I would trade you the rolls that I have for rolls that you have. And nope, they will not do anything. And it's just really, uh-oh, missed a silver one. Come on. We got a 65 right there. I'm not leaving it under the microscope this time because you guys let me forget it. We're putting it right there. Come on. They're like, listen, dude, this is your stream. You take care of it points everywhere do, do, do. yeah I uh, always do. <laughs> need to go to bed and three hours later we're jaws or something come on new line that's supposed to stay in discord <laughs> but new line have you noticed have you noticed haven't seen Anubushu yet come back to any of our streams after uh, uh, after that conversation. Rob is still getting boxes. Yes, he is. Rob is still getting boxes. And trust me, I talk to him every day. I know how, and I know what the deal is. Yes, Rob is still getting boxes. Is that my fault? I don't know, New Line. I don't know, brother. 
I'll, uh, you know what? I'll be the responsible one here. I'll take the, I'll take the uh, fault for it. You never know. We got a silver quarter. Come on for Roy Hathaway. Your jaws like your merch is <laughs> just. That's the uh, that's the dehydration from being outside for the last few days. Scared everyone out of movie chat, right? TJ is getting more. Yes, I do know that too. Again, another person that I talk to just about every day. Rob and TJ and I uh, actually have a group chat together. Because <laughs> I was getting to the point where it's like I'm texting TJ and I'm texting Rob and I'm just like, Put it together. It's the same same thing. Uh oh, right there. Come on, Roy. We got a 40. A 1967. Right there. Come on. Rack it up. Come on, Roy. Come on, feel the noise. Where'd it go? Do, 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 do. Tell them to share their secret. Their secret is be nice to the bank and uh, know the bank and be good to the bank. That's their secret. I'll tell you right now. Is that they have such a good standing with their banks that they are going to get boxes whenever the banks can. That's exactly what they do. I just shared it to everybody. Robert saves history. How's it going? Alfred R. lurking up in the chat. What's going on, brother? I believe Alfred's probably still at work, so he's probably got his phone going and just like peeking in when he can. We got a dime right there. Come on, Roy. Right there. That is it. Roy Hathaway. Here we go. We got a Walker. A Walker. One, two, three, 40, 65, 67, and 67. Two dimes. Let's add another dime and let's add a quarter. Come on. New line says I'm going to need my own channel on Discord. <laughs> oh, geez. And there we go. Not that bad. That's a nice shiny 64. All right. And let's grab a quarter. Let's see. Good night, Ben. Have a good one. We'll see you later. And good to see you back. Let's see. Let's find a nice one that's not a 64. How about that? How about that? There's a 52 right there. Right there. Robert Saves Histories. I've been Rob Stream, but passed out, been moving, so I finished moving Monday. I've been unpacking since Monday evening. Nice. Yep, there's a lot of people moving around here lately that uh, haven't been coming into work because they've been trying to get their house set up, which is totally, totally understandable. I actually had somebody today call me and it's like, I really want to come into work because I really want to help you guys. And I'm like, no, I think you need to uh, go ahead and stay at home. I had somebody close on a house yesterday and they were calling me to see if they could come to work today. I was like, probably not a good idea. I've never bought a house, but I moved into a lot of them. And I know that's not a one day ordeal. So I'm gonna need you to uh, go ahead and get that set up. But there we are. How are we looking on likes? How are we looking on likes? If anyone, anyone, if a site selling silver each night, that's way too good to be true, silver, silver bowl. Especially if you saw it on Instagram or Facebook, it's a scam. Moving is a pain in the butt. Worldpesos.com. Yeah, I don't even I don't even know that website. No, I don't doesn't it doesn't even seem legit. 110, 112. All right. What's up, Gringo? Fakes from China. Yep. Yep. Totally, totally too good to be true. Fake, fakeroo, fakeroo. All right, so I was told people would be interested in auction stuff. I have three things, well, three types of things, I guess, that I could do. But they're going to be 
They're not going to be cheap ones. One of them's a little bit. But you guys let me know. I've got the Geiger squares. I've got graded peace dollars. And I've got one silver pour right now that I could auction. Gringo with the 4.99 says I fell asleep. <laughs> Thank you, Gringo, for that. Oh man, that's hilarious. I got a bridge I'll sell for cheap. I'm not falling for it. Can we see? Okay, man. Yep, right here. So this is the this is the silver pour. It's the rippled pour. Nobody's seen that one yet. I uh, I did it and then just kind of waited on it. It's 2.27. So that's the poured bar right there. And then I do have some of the um, Nada Kennedys, the Geiger squares left. And I have a stack of graded peace dollars. What's the start on that two third roll? Jonathan Friend, that's not getting auctioned off. That's not getting auctioned off. I would have to figure out a price on that one. Worldpesos.com doesn't sound sketchy at all. Yeah, right. Have some Oceanside property in New Mexico. I'll sell you for cheap. Oh, no. I'm not the one falling for it. I'm not the one falling for it or questioning it. And I'll tell you right now, I hope nobody does fall for stuff like that. Not a chance. It's like that song, Oceanfront Property in Arizona. How much for the beaver? Nancy said, oh, no auction. Oh, there's going to be an auction, Nancy. But not for that one, that two-thirds roll of 63 uh, Benjis that I have. 62, Jonathan. They are, I think all of them actually are graded 62. Yes. But we'll only do one tonight. One Geiger, one Peace Dollar, and the Poured Bar. One hundred percent down for Sunday, though. New line. I might, I might be able to make some pours for Sunday. You just never know what's going on with my schedule. Never know what's going on. All right, so we'll do three things. We will do the three things. Just a quick one. See, I didn't send an email. Let me know what you think after stream. Okay, T. Love it. Laundry mat provides change. Made it through the full box cord to give me change. If only I knew. I barely do laundry from searching, finding stuff. Yeah. I still go to the car washes and get some of those. I still go. I'm, our laundry mat doesn't do coins. So, yeah. You have to go somewhere else and get coins to use the laundry mat. But, yeah. All right. Let's see. All right. So, we will do this. We will do this. Um, I'm going to do the starts. And then we're going to do the peace dollar first, the Geiger, and then the poured bar. So here is the peace dollar right here. I'll show it and then I'll do the auction in the chat like normal. That's a 1923. You can see the grade 62 and the number if you want to look at it. Just look at it. And let me bring up all right see I can see that right there all right so here we go if you want it and it's going to be starting bid of 22 20 Two. Rob finds treasures in the house. What's going on, Rob? What's going on? Good to see you, brother. I hope dinner was good. I don't know what you guys ended up having. I heard mac and cheese, so definitely going to have to go check the community tab for that one. Oh, look, Carl is at 30. 
Carl is at 30, starting off right there. He said, screw 22, new line at 32. Holy cow, mac and cheese, he said. That's awesome. I'm going to have to go look at community tab later. going to have to look at community tab. I had frozen pizza, but it wasn't delivery. New lines at 32. Holy cow. Let's see. Mac and cheese with ketchup. All right, Dick is at 33. Coming in hot. There it is. And I just got these new stickers in today, the so these are going to go. Now they're my original design, but they're sticker mule stickers, so they're the, I call them fuzzy ones, but they're the, the matte finish instead of the shiny ones. All right, let's see. So Dick is at 33. Let's see, going once. And going twice. And we'll counter down. Oh, Roy. Roy came in at 34. Stacy at 35. Trying to snipe it. There is no snipe in here. If you want to bid, you just bid. There we go. Oh, new line came back at 37. He says, uh-uh. Uh -uh. Come on. He says, bring it on. Bring it on. New Line's like, listen, I'm about to wake up now. I'm about to wake up now. I'm going to need that. We'll flip it over. You guys can see the other side. Break on to, to the other side. Right there. Stacy coming in at 40. Holy cow. Dick says, get her, get her new line. <laughs> I think I'm actually, my knee is bleeding from where I hit it earlier. Ed Stonewall coming in at 45. Holy cow. Ed is at 45. Holy moly. I don't really do slides, but she's pretty. Why is my phone going off? Oh, I got people. I have people message me on Instagram. Got it. Oh, with authority, he says. And Stacy comes in at 50. Holy cow. And the knee scab. You get the knee scab with it. That doesn't come in about a week, though, when it scabs over. <laughs> I know. That is a nice one, Rob. That is a nice one. Compared to every other one that I have, I'm like, mm, some of these are pretty, pretty nice. Just sent you something on Instagram. I know, Pickle. That's what I just buzzed on. I was wondering. There we go. So we are at with Stacy at 50 right now. Let's see where we get. Holy cow. So let's go going once for Stacy. Going twice for Stacy Oakley Triller. Ed Stonewall coming in. At 55, holy moly. Asa, what's going on, brother? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. New line, it's a 23, man. Right there is the label. I guess I could turn the light down so you guys could see it a little bit better. Right there is the label, 1923. And look at the front. Oh, the obverse is just... Nice. Nice. Stacy coming in at 60. Holy cow. Stacy's coming in hot. She's just like, listen, listen, mine. Joe Nelson's like, what, what? Uh oh. Uh oh. Daniel Wilson, good to see you. So pretty. I love Peace Dollars. Probably one of my favorite ones. All right, let's see. Stacy going once. Stacy going once at 60. 60. Come on now. New line says, I'm out. Got you, brother. She does want it. And let's see. Going twice. Let's counter down. Five, four. 
Three to one. And sold to Stacy for 60. Holy cow. Stacy Oakley Triller. I almost want to say Thriller every time. And Stacy, there we go. Holy cow. Thank you, Stacy, for that. Ed Stonewall says, I'm out. Yeah, no problem, brother. No problem at all. Three to one. <laughs> Gotta love it. There we go. Congrats, Stacy, on that one. Let me get it. Where'd it go? It's under the microscope again. Come on now. Let me write this down. Stacy, and I have something for calling me out. So, do you want me to put them together, Stacy? You let me know. I do have something for calling me out, so I can put those together if you would like me to, or I can ship them separate. Up to you. Wasn't expecting an auction tonight, were you? Well, no, Jonathan. I even said I wasn't going to have an auction, but when enough people say, "Hey, I'll take it. I'll do, we'll do an auction," then I'll do one. I give the people what they want, brother. <laughs> Used to think people was thriller. Yeah, I have a big thing about names. I have a big thing about names. So definitely uh, I like to get names right. All right, here we go. Here we go. The next one. All right, here we go. Are we ready? Here we go. 20 gram Geiger stare square starting bid at 20 right there right there it's a 20 gram geiger square so right there and i'll put it under the microscope here in a second so right there you can't really see it yes stacy please use goods and services and uh yep you don't owe shipping because i already have something for calling me out so no big deal on that one and there we go we got a bunch of 25 so i see desert rat sacro but i see carl coming in at 30 right there Hey, Pammy Jones, good to see you as well. Pammy at 35, coming in hot. Holy cow. There we go. And then I will flip her over so you guys can see. Dick coming in with 30. Here we go. Doobie, doobie, do. Pammy coming back. Says, you know what? 38. Bring it on. Bring it on. Holy cow. Dick comes back. He answers with 40. He says, mine, bro. Mine. Pammy comes in. At 45 for that 20 gram Geiger square. Holy moly, right there. I will do that and we'll flip her over again. New line, stop it. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. Hey, Mustang Dave, have a good Mustang Dave. Have a good night, brother. All right, let's see. Pammy at 45 going once. Pammy had 45, going twice. <laughs> Rob. Oh, man. All right, here we go. And we're going to count her down. Five, four, <laughs> uh, three to one. Right there and sold to Pammy for 45. <laughs> Holy cow. That Jawser size thing is just. Too much, too much. Pammy Jones, thank you very much. And uh, please send me an email. Let me put this on here, auction. Geiger Square, Square, 45. Holy moly. Stop it, new line. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> and the shake weight. Oh, man. 
Oh, jeez. Pammy Jones, thank you for that. We will get that out to you. Uh, I do do uh, PayPal goods and services. Um, yes, and please, if you would, add the shipping on that. So it's four um, for the shipping as well. Let me write it down here. Pammy Jones, 45. There we go. Holy cow. Holy cow. All right. I don't want to see any of New Line's uh, search history. And New Line, if that comes to my house, they're just going to turn into golf balls and they're going to go. They're going to go bye bye. All right. What's the silver spot price at right now? Where are we at? Let's use. I'll go to Coinflation. I'll look at the silver spot price right now. And it is 27.23. So let's go to the calculadora. 27.23 times 2.27 ounces. That is 61.81. We are going to start it at 60 dollars. 60 right there. So 28-ish, 27.28. Either way. All right. So. Uh, bar starting bid at 60 right there so we got jonathan friend at 60 whoa not 650 jonathan friend at 60 dick's coming in at 70 holy moly right there and i'll flip it over to the other side break on through to the other side there it is there we go we got dick lacrosse at 70 few little ripples in that guy right there oh flip it this way so 2.27 and a three nines fine with the stamp they all love can I zoom out well I can't zoom out on the scope anymore but I can bring it right here that's all I can do for zoom so right there, Jonathan Friend said 72. And here we go. But the microscope's is up as far as it can go. Well, actually, I guess I could do this. And I could put the camera up a little bit further. New lines coming in at 80. New lines coming in hot at 80. Let's see if I can do this right there. There we go. She's thick. <laughs> Dick coming in at 81. Jonathan says, I'm out. All right, Jonathan, thank you for bidding. <clears throat> oh, man, you guys are crazy. All right, let's see. So Dick's coming in at 81. Let's see. We're going once. And we'll be going twice. Uh-oh, New Line came in. He's like, listen, bro. You be putting that shiny stuff on the screen. I'm going to keep bidding on it. New Line said 83. <laughs> New Line. All right, here we go. New Line, 83, going one time. Dick says, I'm out. You can, you go get her. Going once. We're going to say going twice. Come on. Here we go. We're going to go ahead and join the heist while we're at it. And five, four, three, two, one. And sold to New Line. What was it? 83. Sold to New Line for 83. Holy cow. Thank you, New Line. And do I already have something for you from last stream? I do, so you don't owe shipping on that one. But thank you very much. You guys know how I do PayPal. Yeah, he's gonna be the one that's gonna flood this heist. We're all gonna get clapped. <laughs> Nick, I'm the one that always dies on heist. I always die on heist. 
Don't you worry about that. I'm just trying to just trying to give you guys some of my coins. That's all it is. So there we go. New line. Thank you very much, brother. Let's put this in here. And I will do up the COA for it and everything uh, before I send it. Right there. There we go. Let's put this here with your other one. We will get all that sent out tonight. Looking forward to the custom pour tomorrow. Oh, yeah, your pour. Yep. Make a wonderful meet. Stop, stop it, Nick. New line. <laughs> hey, Mason Foster. Good, good to see you, man. Oh, geez. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you very, very much. I look forward to seeing you on the next stream. I should be able to stream on Saturday at noon. Uh, we'll see how work goes. We may. Big Mill and I were talking about doing it at a different time and also doing it at a different time on his channel, depending if I'm gonna have to be at work at that time. So, play it by ear. We'll do that, we'll do that. We'll, my favorite thing, stay flexible, right? Did I just get points in a heist? 20,000, there we go. Lord, Larry Powell's the one that won. Rob got 20,000, Yo Adrian got 5,000. All right, all right, you guys have a great night. Thank you so much, take care of each other. We will see you guys all on the next stream. Thank you to the members. Thank you to all the subscribers that have been here tonight. Holy cow, how many people do we still have left in here? 55. We have 55 people right now. Go raid Kittle Got Game. Just completely put something in the chat because it's going to confuse the tar out of him. Go raid Kittle Got Game, and I will see you guys there if you go there. Have a great night, and we'll see you on the next stream. Dang it, I forgot to do an end of stream. How many people are still here? See, you guys got to keep me in line. You guys got to keep me in line. I knew it. I knew it. I knew I forgot something. Sweet Jeebus again. There it is. It says we still got quite a few people in here. So let's do it. End of stream. Get in there. Enter space one. Enter space one. Go get in there. Holy cow. We'll make it a little bit better since I done almost forgot it again. Jeez. Holy cow. This is coming straight out of the BU roll. <coughs> Holy moly. Everybody enter space one. Get in there. I see you guys entering. Oh, man. This is going to be a lot less people. Oh, we lost 20 people. Holy moly. All right. Either way, let's go. We got, I'm going to give you 38 more seconds. 38 more seconds. Let's get in there. Oh, I can't believe it. I need like a big sign that says, do the end of stream. That's what I need. You know what? I'm going to get a flip for this one, too. Maybe. I think I got flips in there still. That is not a half dollar flip. Come on, now. Still interesting. Jaws are sizing with my referral link. We don't like to mention it because it's nice. Oh man. All right, let's see. Where's my flips? Hmm. There we are. Come on now. All right. Need to get a referral link. Oh, geez. All right, here we go. We are done on that. Let's do it. Good luck to everybody, and thank you for being here for the extra 15 seconds. Oh, man. Five, four, three, two, one. Pick again. Five, four, three, two, one. Brandon Drakon. 
Brandon, speak up. You got it. Let's go. Where'd my good stapler go? Have you seen my diddler? I'm telling you, I gotta quit changing stuff around around here. Where is he? There he is. All right, congratulations, Brandon. Send me an email to remind me. Pretty sure I still have your address, but just so when I go through all the emails when I'm doing shipping, I can get that out to you. So there we go. I will put it in here. <laughs> Where's my red swing line? Mine's actually a pink one, but... You finally got picked and it's for your own stream. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. I, I always like to enter my own just to see if it'll pick me. There we go. Brandon. There we go, Brandon. Congratulations on that. All right. Now, now you guys all have a great night. I'll see you over at Kittle God Game. And have a good night. And I'll see you on the next stream.